Lashes and skin care for the Talk 365 team is provided by AP Med Spa. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Holly Love, and that is Trip Mitchell. And coming at you right now is our wellness news you can use. And today we are talking about a hot topic, which is the flu shot. Have you had yours? I have mine. And there is flu shot, not to flu shot, Trip Mitchell. You should flu shot. So okay, here why? is here is why you should flu shot. In life, you play the percentages. Okay. So you don't play some actress. The one actress who's against immunization, for instance. Okay. You do not get your health advice from a B-list actress that was on Two and a Half Men, and that so wow. you really don't. You go with doctors. Uh -huh. I know this is. You know what happens is these stars who yes. last time I checked have not been to medical school mm -hmm. can get press and shoot off. And are there examples where immunization has caused problems? Yes. Absolutely. We won't deny it. Are there cases where people have gotten sick from a flu shot? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. But are you going to give up the 99% chance that this is going to be beneficial? And a flu is the worst thing. You you know, cold, you, you can get through. Yeah. But the flu, it keeps you home from work. It can get your kids sick. It can get their kids sick. And it's just, it's horrible to get. So I think immunization for sure, and listening to all the Hollywood buzz, it's interesting how people are like, well, polio doesn't exist anymore. Well, yeah, because there were, we've, we've stamped it out. It's going to come back. So I'm 1,000% with you, and I think you should research it. Like if you have a very small baby, maybe ask for half doses and ask for them to spread it out. I mean, it's wise to get educated. We don't stop, though. There, there are things you can do, like you were saying, with your doctor to figure out how to prevent maybe your child having a reaction to a vaccine. But with the flu, I had this out with my friend Andy last night, and he's medical. So he said... On one hand, always, he's on your side. He said, definitely go with your doctor. He and his girls had just got their flu shot yesterday. And I have never, ever, ever had a flu shot, ever. So I I, I don't know. It's just something I don't do. And I do a, a lot of herbs and a lot of things like that to stay healthy that I feel like sort of combat it. But I do sort of understand the theory side of, they just guess that the next year, they don't really know what flu well, strain is going to come Well, there are a bunch of different strains, and, but it's... But so, he did say at the end of the day, even if they're wrong on the strain, it still strengthens your immune system and allows you to better fight it off. And so it does work. It does its job. Yeah. So here's our advice. When it comes to your health, check with your doctor. When it comes to your health, don't check with a B-list actress who hasn't worked in seven years and was on Two and a Half Men. Does my, does my herb doctor count? No. Yes, it, he does. It's got to be an MD. MD. That's important. They go to school for seven to twelve but years. But he has like a thing on his on his head, and he wears robes. All right, everybody, check this out. Coming at you right now is our wellness minute from Green Horizon. They just had their grand opening a week ago. It went fantastically, and through the month of December, they are going to give you a twenty five percent discount off of your full order, either in store or online. I highly recommend their CBD oil. It's amazing. My back feels better. How's your shoulder? Well, I haven't. I had the light stuff. I need more. Okay, we're going to get him some more. But here's Jenny with your Wellness Minute. Talk 365's Wellness Minute is brought to you by Talking Wellness Weekend. Hi, I'm Jenny Carlson with Green Horizon. When people find out that I have CBD, there's always five questions that I get asked hands down. One, that's marijuana, right? No, it's not marijuana. Marijuana is a made up name for cannabis. Hemp is from the cannabis family, but it's kind of the responsible uh, plant of the two. <laughs> um, the second one is like, well, it's illegal, right? No, CBD has been legal forever. It's never been illegal. So all 50 states we can ship and even sometimes up into our neighbors to the north in Canada. The third question we get asked is, am I gonna get high? Just even a little bit? And fortunately for some, and unfortunately for others, and we don't judge which one of those you fit into, you're not gonna get high, not even a little bit. We have zero THC in our CBD oil, so you don't even have to worry about it. No handcuffs, no failing drug tests, no arrests. You're totally fine, no high. Uh, then people wanna know where we get it from. Well, because imported hemp is the only legal hemp currently in America, we get it from Austria, Switzerland, and sometimes Canada. Because we're not sure of the legality of getting it from our neighbors uh, from Colorado, we just wanna stay on the high side of the law and make sure we get it imported. They also have really high GMO standards, so they have banned GMOs. They're all organic, no pesticides, so we know we have a really good product. The last question we get is, well, what is it good for? And I wanna be like, it's good 
good for everything what you got it's good for that but <laughs> I can't because the FDA won't let me say anything so if you google it CBD is good for you're gonna find a whole bunch of things so for more information on CBD you can go to our website green horizon zen because we're zen dot com or come find us at our store in Kaysville 140 North Main Street Suite D